Hey guys, Beast here, and I want to show you the Vapor water bottle. Uh, initially, I saw these on ITS Tactical. Um, I had the chance while going down to Arizona with the Haas USMC that Vapor gave him a couple to test, and he gave me one to use. While we were down there in the Arizona desert, obviously very formidable environment. You got cactuses and rocks and the heat and everything. At night, we would put fill these up, obviously not totally full, but put these in the freezer to freeze them so we'd have something cold to drink during the, uh, the heat of the desert during the day. And they survived wonderfully. Now, Vapor obviously didn't realize that I had one to test, and you never know where your products are going to end up. This particular one I had for six months while working on the ship down in the Antarctic Peninsula. It went everywhere. Probably the photos that I'm showing you at the beginning. You know, it went everywhere to the beaches. I clipped this thing on our safety barrels on the Zodiacs, and it was just nice. You knew on a Zodiac ride, you know, that thing wasn't flopping around. It wasn't getting underneath people's feet. You knew exactly where it was when you needed it. Now, this very one that I had for over a year, took it everywhere, um, did develop a leak. It developed a leak this summer. Hopefully you can see it's right there at the edge and it's right where this seam comes up and starts and it was kind of a potential worry um, you know the Haas and I had talked about whether we thought it would hold up and it was really doing really well um, I actually really like this water bottle you, you really start to utilize water bottles on a daily basis and you start to get used to them and you miss them when you don't have them um, to say I was heartbroken when this thing developed a leak, um, it, there's a little bit of truth to that because you get used to that. Uh, now it is made in the USA. Um, we'll go over kind of the specs here. A little carabiner on top. Now you have to forgive, this did get spray painted brown at one point. It all wore off. Cap comes off. Nice click. It's got a little bit of rubber here nice tactical response one of the things that I really liked about this is you could grab it flick it open with one hand and easily be drinking on it while you're doing something with another hand it's got a nice small aperture on here it's just enough to get all the water you want without more water like a Nalgene that's come gushing out all over the place now you can unscrew the actual top decent size you know ice cubes are gonna be a little bit limited in there but you know faucets everything else is gonna be super easy to fill didn't have any issues with o-rings never had the clip fail never had any of it fail until just that little section down there that we just talked about so went online tried to find it really like this color it comes in all sorts of colors including a bunch that none of us would ever want probably i'm not sure where their bright sort of barbie color comes from but maybe it's trendy nowadays i prefer actually the green uh, in the orange not that it's you know super tactical cool, but I like the subdued color I like to be able to see how much water is inside this happens to be the 0.7 liter and you kind of see the size difference what I found with the 0.7 liter was it I was filling it too often um, the one liter ones online were sold out for a long time as I went back to Amazon and a few other places um, and you can also see the color change it has a basically a shiny appearance, at least the ones we got from the Haas, and we'll see how the other ones do over the next year. But the one here that I got, I haven't used as much because I just found I was filling it too much. So what was the choice? Was I went back to the people I first saw this product from, which was ITS Tactical. You can see their logo there. It says Vapor on that side. And you can kind of see there's the color difference. This one it seems a little bit darker green, it's very, not very noticeable at all but 0.7 liter was just I had to fill it too much when you use it that much it's going to be drinking that much water I really like it and I've had no issues with this I have continued to freeze it I'm not afraid to freeze that there you go guys vapor collapsible water bottle um, I'll put some links I believe Haas has done a review uh, I'll put a link for the ITS tactical where I first saw it and again this is where I got this one from with a cool ITS logo on it but very happy with the product. It clips onto anything, had no worries. This clip does come off if you pry hard enough, but it comes off underneath. So as long as you have the weight of the water bottle on there, 
it's not really an issue it's not something i ever ran into you know the clip isn't the strongest thing in the world you can put the clip on the outside but again in average day testing use pull the clip off if you don't want it but i was clipping this thing onto boats clipping it onto the truck clipping it everywhere never had an issue with it and then this is the wandering beast for the vapor water bottle signing off guys you guys have a great day